Billy Hartman, your top seed, 213.32 this morning, a personal best for her. Of course, Leah Smith, second in the 400 IM this week, one of the greatest freestylers in American history. Also showing her strong abilities in the IMs this week. Frozen in lane five, 10th all time in the national age group rankings as an 18 year old. But at the 50, it's Beta Nelson, top 25 all-time American performers in this event. Olympic trials finalist in the 200 IM. She's out in the 2740. Skirball in lane number eight. 17-year-old out of Racer X Aquatics. 28-21 on the butterfly leg. How about a full second faster on that first 50 for Skirball? Vita Nelson looks determined and way ahead of everyone else. Almost a second and a half lead over second place, which is Aaron Gimmel, the 17 year old from Nation's Capital. Vita Nelson, 101 26 the split. She was 33 8 on the backstroke leg. Nelson, a solid second ahead of her prelim self. But here come the breaststrokers. You don't think of Leah Smith as a breaststroker, but she's been demonstrating that quite a few years now at international team trials this week as well in the 400 IM. Zoe Hartman, who was in the championship final of the 100 breaststroke consolation final winner in the 200. Also in the mix, Hartman in third. Smith in second. Beat it, Nelson in the lead. Can Leah Smith leverage that incredible freestyle of hers to make the pass on the final 50? Callie Dickinson, excuse me, Zoe Hartman taking a look to her left. She's watching Smith. Watch out for lane number two, Ellen Nelson as well. And what a final 50 from Leah Smith. She's gonna win it in a 211.67, tying her personal best time, finishing in a 30.59. Hartman in a 2.12.04, dropping another full second off of her personal best to finish second, and then Vita Nelson at a 2.12.46, finishes in third. Leah, that was so exciting coming down the stretch. You match your personal best. Just take us through the race and how you were able to get it done. Yeah, um, that was super fun out there. I uh, wanted to get a best time. Um, second best is tying it, so yeah. You, you've been a stalwart of Team USA for so many years. You've had ups and downs, but you've had such a great year, especially joining the pro group at Texas. What continues to be the key for you? Yeah, I think uh, the key to my swimming this year was just an added level of gratitude. Um, I'm especially grateful to be out here in Irvine. This was the pool that I made my first senior national team at, so it holds a special place in my heart. Well, Team USA has a special place in its heart for you. Congratulations. Thank you.